Today we are going to make a spider. Inflate uh, four balloons leaving about one inch flat tail to make the legs. Squeeze the balloon, forcing the air inside to the very end of the flat tail. We are going to use one balloon to make a pair of uh, spider legs. Fold the balloon in half to find the center. That's where we are going to twist the balloon. We can twist one balloon at a time. Or faster, better, twist three balloons in one move. Hold three balloons at the center in one hand and twist. Uh, basically we have made six legs. We can uh, leave them as it is or improve them a bit. Fold a leg in half. At the center of the leg we twist and lock. Both ends of about two inch bubble. We do it in uh, one move. Work one leg at a time. This is uh, a kind of a knee bubble. This bubble helps to keep the leg in a fixed position. How many legs does spider have? I've got so many different answers for this question. Usually I make as many legs as my client wants. Sometimes, uh, especially little kids, uh, they like to have um, a spider with uh, two legs and two arms. Usually it means they want a Spider-Man, not a spider. Okay, we have made six legs. Put them aside for now. Inflate a different color balloon, leaving up to two inch flat tail. We are going to make the body of the spider. Fold the balloon four times. We are going to twist four bubbles of the same size, one quarter of the balloon. Twist a chain of four bubbles. Actually, we are going to twist uh, five bubbles. The fifth, the last bubble, could be of any size. I use the fifth bubble to make the head of the spider. So here we have made a chain of five bubbles. Lock both ends of the chain of the first four bubbles in one lock twist. Lock both ends of the chain of uh, two, the second and third bubble in one lock twist. Now we can use the fifth bubble to lock both ends of chain of two, the first and second or third and fourth bubble in one lock twist. But first, I want to put uh, the spider legs uh, inside between bubbles of the body. Now we lock the bubbles of the body. Of course, uh, make sure to place the same number of legs on either side of the spider body. Fix legs in proper positions. We have to add just a couple more details to this sculpture. The sculpture already looks like a spider. Let's take a look at the sculpture. Here's the side view. The top view. The bottom view. The front view. We can use the fifth bubble as it is. Just keep it this way. Or we can lock both ends uh, of the fifth bubble in one lock twist. The fifth bubble represents the head of the spider. We can use a permanent marker to draw the eyes, nose, mouth. I rather use a different color balloon to make the eyes. Let's twist a chain of two soft, about one inch bubbles. As you can see I made it very soft. Lock all ends of both bubbles in one lock twist. Here's the second bubble. Now we lock them in one lock twist. It's quite simple, just time consuming. Um, use scissors or your fingers to cut off the rest of the balloon. We have made the eye bubbles. 
attach the eye bubbles between the body and the head of the spider. Fix the eye bubbles on the top of the head. Now we can use the permanent black marker to draw the face of the spider. Here I draw the eyes right on the eye bubbles. My spider is kind of sad. Yeah, very sad eyes. We can compensate it with smile and teeth. Here's a big smile and teeth. I think it's a cute spider. A couple dots to make the nose. I'm missing something here. What is it? Aga, our spider has six legs. We have to make it right. So here's a fourth balloon. Again, fold it in half, twist the bubbles. I'm going to use this balloon to make the front legs. So I force uh, this balloon uh, between bubbles of the body in uh, the front part of the body. We can leave the uh, the balloon as it is. Or we can uh, shape the front legs. Or we can uh, twist the knee bubbles to fix the front legs in proper positions. Alright, so I twist the knee bubbles and fix the legs in proper positions. Congratulations! We have made the spider. Here's a side view. And uh, the front view. The bottom view. Alright. One spider is good. Um, let's make a couple more spiders to have more fun. There are different ways to make and to use the same spider body. Inflate a balloon leaving up to 2 inch flat tail. Again we're going to twist 4 bubbles of uh, 1 quarter of balloon size. Lock both ends of the chain of the first 2 bubbles in one lock twist. Twist the third bubble of 1 quarter size of the balloon. Lock the free end of the third bubble between the first and the second bubbles. Basically so far we have made Three-fold head. How about we get rid of the flat tail? Yes, why not? Twist the fourth bubble, one quarter size of the balloon. The rest of the balloon is the fifth bubble. Now we can uh, lock the body bubbles and then attach the legs. Or let's do it the easier way. Place the uh, spider legs between set of three bubbles and the fourth bubble of the body. Lock the free end of the fourth bubble with the set of three bubbles of the body. Fix all bubbles in proper positions. In this sculpture the top of the body has um, three bubbles and the bottom of the body has uh, only one bubble. Ok. Now we can attach the fourth pair, uh, the front legs. Spiders are very popular during Halloween season. That is why I use um, the most popular Halloween colors. Um, black, orange, uh, purple to make uh, all spiders. Of course we can use uh, different color balloons. One more thing about the spider legs. I didn't make it here. But you may want to twist one or better two small soft bubbles. Uh, right in the middle, where we 
uh, locked all legs uh, bubbles in one lock twist just to help to keep the legs in fixed positions. So here's the side view, the bottom view, front view. Now I'm going to attach a set of two white uh, bubbles, eye bubbles uh, between the head and the body. Fix the eye bubbles on the top of the head. Use a permanent black marker to draw the eyes. All right, all done. Congratulations, we have made a spider. Here's the top view, the front view, the side view. And the bottom view. Now we can take a look at uh, our boss spiders. I really feel like to make uh, one more spider. In this instruction we use the same four fold body. The only difference is how many bubbles we use to make the top of the body. We can use three bubbles or we can use um, two bubbles to make the top of the body. And here are the spider's legs in the simplest form. This time there is no knee bubbles as you can see. I am making a, a kind of flat spider. I think of this uh, kind of flat spiders as um, a good decoration on walls. Now we have to make the front legs. It is all the same. I use um, one balloon to make two legs or one pair of legs. For the front legs between bubbles of the body. Fix all legs bubbles in uh, proper positions. Now I have to fix the head of the spider. Of course we can leave it as it is. Just decorate the head with a, a permanent black marker. But frankly I do like to make um, the head uh, more round shape and uh, attach eye bubbles to it. This time I use red balloon to make uh, eye bubbles. Or should I call it um, bloody eyes. Just to scare little kids. Yeah I know there is no need for it. Some of you already have nightmares because of my voice. I do realize how horrible my voice sounds. I want to save you from my singing. I made all my instructions in um, different formats. Go to my website fewdoit.com. Over there you find links to all instructions. Each instruction includes photos, text and links to videos. So you can actually read the instructions instead of hurting your hearing. Alright, back to the spider. I use uh, a permanent black marker to draw the face. Almost forgot to draw the nose. Let's give it a hard shape. Okay. I think I mentioned it before, but um, anyway. Uh, we can shape the legs uh, without use of uh, knee bubbles. It's very simple. Just bend the leg bubbles one by one. I personally prefer to use um, knee bubbles for this purpose. With um, knee bubbles the sculpture keeps the shape better and longer time. Which is also an important point. Okay, dokie. Let's fix all bubbles in proper positions. Congratulations again. 
we have made the spider. Have fun and happy twisting.